welcome good back. Evening, good evening. Welcome, I'm really enjoying back. that team tune. I'm really enjoying that team tune. <laughs> yeah, you didn't see, but we were all kind of doing this. They can't see us, but the theme tune's playing. But... Shame that. <laughs> How are you all today? How good are you stuff. today? I'm very good today. You Thank you. Absolutely. We're having, um, I'm having a whiskey tasting with Shelly. We have a off, right. offline, yeah. offline uh, whiskey tasting, life. and we have a very good lineup. I'm not going to share what's in it because you know some of those who are going to be joining us this evening may be Indeed. watching. So, but it is a very exciting 100%. lineup. So that's yep. that's cool. Cool. Indeed, that's cool. Yes. And what else? What's going on in the whiskey world? You were telling me something, Shelley. Um, I was reading today. Whoops. Oh, lost my pen. I was <laughs> reading um, about Cotswolds have just released, uh, um, they've talked about their fourth uh, single cask expression, mm, bourbon cask, oh, which oh. for the Cotswolds distillery, which have a very fruity mm. spirit, mm -hmm. so it should be a very good com uh, like combination. So I'm actually quite excited to try that. So yeah, and, and uh, if you recall, when we went to visit Bimba, yeah. um, Bimba was actually talking about you know, liaising with Cotswold and a couple of others to actually get into law what is classified as Indeed. English whiskey. Yes. Because obviously, um, Scotch has legal requirements as to what can and can't be called Scotch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so Bimba is leading that push. Um, and I think Cotswold's involved in yes, that. Yes, they are. And the English um, whiskey company. And English whiskey Dartmoor, company. I think they all so are. Indeed. they're all pushing the government Absolutely. to, to clarify. And yeah. I, I also read recently that in, in Wales, they're also pushing for a Welsh cash right. classification. Right. Wow. So that that's that's very interesting. And we definitely know that English whiskey has got that collectible value yeah. on certain brands, not all the brands, yeah. but certain brands has that appeal like Scotch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's it's one to watch out. Indeed. Cool. I wonder what will happen with that. Indeed. We've got a very, very exciting <sighs> exciting selection of things going on yes. today. A lot going on today. Okay. Mm. So we are gonna pick out a winner for this feta can which we tasted mm -hmm. yesterday, which was lovely. Mm -hmm. Feta can twelve. Yeah. That was pina colada on the beach. <laughs> it was pina colada. <laughs> Somebody commented yesterday, I can't remember who it was, but they said it's like um dried pineapple. Yeah, and like I read that afterwards, I'm like, yes, exactly. That it was the, it was the pina colada yeah. on the way. Yeah, lovely. Indeed. Um, and then we have oh my goodness oh my it's an exciting what? day really good whiskey what? company we did Look promise something good at that it's thursday and on thursday we like to spoil you indeed Absolutely. so we are going to be giving away this glen rothless 25 but not only that not only that guys <laughs> and boys <laughs> we're also going to be giving away this glen Fiddick Winter storm. Winter storm. Winter storm. So the Glen Mothers 25, let me just remind everyone, that is comes in at small change of £320. <laughs> wow. That is a good gift. Just, just your casual yeah, um, just day your, night drive. Just your week, weekday <laughs> drink, <yeah>. exactly. <laughs> and then followed closely by the winter storm mm. at £200. Nice. Wow. So these are serious, serious bottles. Absolutely. And I can't wait. Indeed. I can't wait either. So two little notes so, of space side coming forward. Two little so, notes of space side. Exactly. So we're going to we're gonna try them both today? Well? We are going to try them both today. And also later on. We <laughs> did, will... you, did you see what did you clock? <laughs> <my fingers? laughs> also later, we're yeah. going to be giving everybody, only people watching live, yeah. A chance to win a special dram from our lovely Glenda. From here. Glenda. You can see her today. Yeah. Is this indeed. the first time she's seen? She's, that she's getting a bit away. less shy every day. <laughs> <laughs> she's starting off look at off the camera. Colour. Between... Look at the colour of Glenda, yes. Yeah. Oh, no, but look at Glen Mother's 25 compared to Glenda, and it's got a very yeah, similar colour. That's a good sign. There might be quite a lot of sherry, yeah. sherry there is. drams and lots in this uh, little. Uh... Someone said those two in the US, 1K easy. Well, yeah, got to try and win. <laughs> then, it's, then it's free. Absolutely. <laughs> so, okay. So, how are we winning? What are we doing? So, or should we taste this? Can we crack this open? And start? Oh, we've Absolutely. got to. I can't so wait any longer for that. It's a happy day. Oh my goodness! What a treat to open this. Oh, oh even the box. Wow! Just say how You've got to see that. Oh my goodness! Okay. Oh, good and on. listen, listen, listen. Yeah. Oh, it's that magnet. I love it. When when I pack these ones up sometimes to go yeah. and order, yeah. and when you, you open it up and the fresh wooden smells coming from these boxes, it is just like great. So satisfying. 
So the Glenrothes 25, as ever, they go with their very sort of medicinal laboratory looking. Mm. Does it's like a light bulb? Yeah. yeah. This is all part of their mm -hmm. rebrand. This is the pinnacle of that rebrand. Yeah. And it did win a bunch of awards um, back, I think it was 2018. Oh, yeah. This had like, I know it, like it belonged to Edrington and then Berry Brothers bought it. And I know originally, oh, I don't think it was originally, but it was used a lot in the car. Danny's like, I want to open it. Yeah, I was going to say, you can open the seal, but the pop is mine. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, but it was used a lot as um, in like the Cotty Sark brand, mm -hmm. which also changed hands between Edrington. And I think they swapped it. I think Edrington and Berry Brothers swapped the, the brand for the brand. So here we go. Ready for the ready? Oh, I'm a bit scared. <laughs> I'm scared it's going to go flying. Yeah, don't, don't. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Oh. Oh. I'm not going to lie, that was a that bit was of a not that yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, not not trying, I'm not trying it out. I refuse. <laughs> It is okay. interesting to, to know because, you know, you just mentioned that that went into Kavasar. Yeah. So Thank you. within, when you look at the history of whiskey, yeah. Um, there was a change, I think it was the late 90s, early 2000s, when single malt whiskey became, yeah. you know, it was always, you know, looked at as that premium part. But yeah. In terms of export value and, and demand, it wasn't the same as the blended whiskies. Yeah. But it suddenly just skyrocketed. So that is quite some colour. That wow. is quite some colour. I'm just getting, I'm just getting that smell. Ooh. I've had the serious driving for here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> I've, I've been benefited. stingy, Dad. <laughs> no, you know what? I'm not stingy. We're driving. Yeah, absolutely. Alex, don't drink and drive. <laughs> absolutely oh, not. Definitely. If anyone's part of the yeah. police, do not, do not look <laughs> no, at me. <laughs> it just is like a head in a sweet shop for mm. me. Literally. Candid orange peels as well. So mm. what's interesting about the Glen Mothers 25 is that they've used, they haven't actually specifically broken it down, but they've mm. basically just said mainly first fill sherry. Right. Which will give you the more intense sherry flavors of, you know, raisins, dark fruits, etc. I'm getting a lot of apple on that as well. Yeah, I know what you mean actually. Jackson, you can try some as well. Does Jackson <laughs> yeah. come there? We've, we've got to Here, let Jackson have let a Jackson little try. Oh. See, that was more that satisfying. Was you better leave it to me for now. There we go. That's for Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Here you go. Matthew says, I always get butterscotch with going off this. Yeah, you're, mm -hmm. you're right. I think you're That's right exactly too. what I'm getting. Yeah, it's that creamy, buttery sort of flavour profile. Yeah. Now, when I went to a Harry Potter Let's world, they had now. that, you know, that special drink from Harry Potter. I forgot what it's called now. Oh, I know what it's called. Mead, uh, not mead. Um, it, it's the, butter something. Butter, butter beer. beer. Is it butter beer? Butter beer. I'm a bit speechless. You know what? It's got that amazing wood. It finishes all wood all the way. And it ends as if I just licked. <laughs> oh, I would actually do that. Parent as control. if I just Parent control. <laughs> <laughs> it's too <been> quiet. <laughs> as if we I won't just elaborate licked. further. <laughs> or, like, you know, like wood workshops. Mm. I'm just going to start. <laughs> yeah, I'm not licking anything apart from the, the whiskey. <laughs> And I'm gonna hide behind Glenda. Yeah, and I think that's uh, <laughs> Shelly out. <laughs> this is for me the type of whiskey where you just don't want to talk. You mm. know, you've poured it. You just want to relax and mm. just Mandy admire the craftsmanship. Sadly, not Mandy. This is just me. <laughs> Ask anyone that I work with. <laughs> you get that wine, sweet wine it's flavor, very sweet. and berries. Mm. Oh, I'm just, just so... I just get the, the, the wood, a tiny bit of heat somewhere towards the end. This is, <clears> this is a well, strong rival of last week's Glen mm. Goyne 25. So if you missed it, last week yeah. was Glen Goyne 25. Absolutely. So that's also in the region of £350. Yeah. Today is the Glen Rothers 25, £320. Wow. And this could, and that, could be yours. You know, I always get asked, 
can you tell differences when you buy when you upgrade your whiskies? Yeah. And you just when you get to a certain level, the the quality just it just sings. It just unbelievable the work that goes in you know the timing and yeah so we've got a couple of questions here so watchman says from canada hiya yeah. he says um he's always had like a sulfurous note in his uh Glen mm. have we got that thing i have to say i didn't detect any sulfur because normally i'm a bit of a sulfur snoop 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 and if it's sulfurous it's like the first thing i smell like i'm very tuned mm. into it mm. but i didn't get that at all actually on no topic. neither did i i got I didn't get sulfury notes, but I did get, you know, a kind of coffee-like bitter ending. You know, it was very sweet, and then there was a little bit of that coffee-like bitterness, yeah. which then went back into that sweet spice and oak. This is delicious. It's delicious. Just, exactly it's delicious. Just um, and Matthew great. wants to know, has a whiskey spent all 25 years in the sherry cask? I believe it has, yeah. yes. Wow. Okay. Lovely. And they call it the Saleo range, which I learned today. Saleo is actually a way that they um, they dry the grapes in mm. the sun. Mm. Cool, I suppose linked to the words Solaire, sun, um, and it's quite an old-fashioned method. So, I, and that's what they use to that's make the sherry. So, and that's then that's the fed connection. into that's the connection. If you smell the glass, you're just getting that oak that you were talking about, but it just literally mingles with that sherry. It's just great. I have nothing left to try. Mm. <laughs> I won't. I won't take any more because I. <laughs> I feel for the person who wants to win the bottle. Yeah. So. Okay. As per usual, this bottle that we're tasting can be yours for free. Indeed. All you have to do is like this video, follow our page on whichever social media you're on, slash all of them if you want more chances, and tag some friends in the comments. And if you want extra points. And you always want extra points Absolutely. when there's a Glen yeah. Rothers 25 involved. Um, share this on your feed or your story or both. But that I is say. not all for today. That is not friends. all for today. Yeah. Oh, we more whiskey. This is exciting. This Having inside. a look. Well, let's put it here. At the Glen Fiddick Winter Storm, which is, I believe, inspired by awesome. Ice Wine. <laughs> yes, um, Ice Wine Cast. So yeah. that is um inspired canadian so what they do is they create a dessert wine over in canada yeah mm -hmm. which they harvest the grapes frozen which is quite interesting right. and officially it's meant to give a much sweeter taste to the wine yeah um and they've finished it in the casks that they used really, to make really? that wine yeah. oh, oh that, that was, was better that, that was, was better the noise so that one um it's it's actually okay. only been finished new glass. for new glasses. Yeah. Thank you very much. Here, yeah, there's two. There we are. Okay, fine. So it's only been it's only been finished uh, six months in those wine glasses. So. Um, oh, okay, and it's part of their experimental range. What what which number is it in their range? Do you know? I don't know what number is released, but the one we're trying today is the batch two. Batch two. It's not oh, batch okay. one. All right, Because so the other releases, some of them I thought were. Uh, most of them, they were a bit hit or miss. Like you Some either loved yeah. them or you hated them. I personally loved the IPA because I love those kind of the, the, the hops beer, and yeah. the beery kind of notes. The XX is quite popular. The XX is popular, but I have found that it's a bit marmitey. Yeah. You either really love that or you really. And the, and the Fire and Cane. I'm, Fire and Cane I'm, also I'm a bit hit and miss. Marmite, but yeah. mainly not good marmite. <laughs> <laughs> Mainly hate. <laughs> We've actually, yes, exactly. No, we did have it on. Uh, we did have it on a blind we did. tasting, and actually went results because yeah. some people loved it, mm -hmm. but those people that did not really did not. Yeah, mm, and, it and the, it's a good one to actually have <clears throat> on a whiskey tasting, just because it's so. Um, yeah. So just while we, oh gosh, while we just let that stew, in mm. shall we now? So. Yes, yeah, so you oh, tell winner. them how they, yeah, well, I was ah. going to say, why don't you tell them how they can get hold of this, um, Ah, of this Glenfiddich, Glenfiddich. So, if you want to win this one, it's a little bit different today. So, all you have to do is go to our website and purchase either our unbelievable advent calendar. You can purchase this or the premium. Um, it works the same. Or our fantastic... 
blind tasting subscription box. This is just $99.99 a month. Yep. And you can, we have a big party on the screen where we try all these four drams with no marketing attached. Indeed. I don't know if you can see, but they're blind. Dram one, two, three, and four. Uh, we taste them together, write out our tasting notes, decide which is our favourite. Yeah, yeah. Which is and good because it means that rather than you just watching us taste the whiskey, you yeah. can actually you join can us. Taste along with us, us, which is really fun. Indeed. Um, and meanwhile, what I'm going to do is, like we played yesterday, because that was fun, bonus. Mm. Oh, wait, I didn't own. say the, oh, okay, the, just, the code. Okay, so you can buy either our advent calendar or our blind tasting box, and you just have to put the code big draw in at checkout. Big draw. And, that, and, and that's that all in capitals. The and then somebody will win the Glenfiddich. So, very exciting. Yeah, seeing as you have to purchase something, you're going to have a much larger chance yeah. of winning. Yeah. There's obviously odds, a lot for you to win. The odds are in your favour. That's for this bottle. Yeah. How much does it Whatever in your favour. £200. Pounds. 100 games? Whatever 200 in your pounds. Okay, and is the link to those products in the description? The link to these products are in the description. Oh, all right, well, there you go. So, and you what's the code again? The code is Big Draw. B R G D R A W. Yes, indeed. Fine, so that's to win this, which we're going to taste now. So, let's just do that first. Because that might be calling me from my. Glass. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit of Ooh. Ooh, it's unusual. It's just, yeah, it is because the base liquid has pretty much 21 year Glenfiddich, mm. so it's mainly 21 year Glenfiddich, wow. and then it's only yeah. six months change. You see, Adrian says not whiskey related, but who is that beautiful model? Well, this is Glenda, <laughs> <laughs> and this is Alex. <laughs> I'm not sure which one of the two you're referring to. <laughs> She's drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really know what to say about this because it's actually not doesn't smell that much like anything else that I've sniffed. Yeah, it's. I always find it very interesting that such short finishing times can also change the whiskey so yeah. much. But it's it just, smells very sweet. It does smell it does. very, very it's sweet. Twenty-one year old, isn't mm -hmm. it? And I got mainly. I'm getting mainly bananas. I'm getting a lot of banana. Quite I'm actually getting um, lychee. Oh. I don't need lychee. <laughs> <laughs> I do get what you mean. It does smell like lychee. It's quite winey, like light mm. wine. Huh. Wow. Mm. That's that's very smooth. Very. You've got the dry. The dryness, like a little bit of like a white wine, yeah, a little bit, you know, it's uh -huh. drying, drying right have, back yeah. in my mouth. Yeah, mm -hmm. a, a slight tingle on the spice. I'm a bit lost for words, mm. just be, <laughs> because I normally have lots and lots of adjectives, lots of things to say about a, a particular whiskey, because a lot of things often evoke things. Mm -hmm. that I'm, oh, I'm used, to, I recognise that right this, and this I feel a bit like I'm sort of off piste a bit because mm. it all feels a little bit. It's good. That you're right. There's like very like drying notes mm. in it. Also, surprisingly, the mouth feel is a bit thin because if you look at the glass, it's just like oil coming all the way down there. But when you put it through, it's it's very cooling and refreshing. But it's not a heavy. It's very sweet on the end. It's very mm. sweet. Yeah, it's lovely. Mm -hmm. It would be interesting actually to do a regular tasting to try the regular Glenfiddich 21 mm -hmm. as we'll compared to this one with that. so maybe the winner will uh, enlighten us on their notes it's quite I, I say this is quite good for the summer no, we're yeah, going into very it's very, it's very pleasant. Pleasant. It's summery it's almost sweet. like a liqueur on the end mm -hmm. as you finish mm -hmm. it okay all right well but meanwhile as just a little side thing, if you've got your phone, Danny, so you can have a look at some of the Instagram uh, comments. But what we're going to do is we're going to give away, again, a taste of Glenda. A taste of Glenda, <laughs> our lovely infinity bottle. Yes, indeed. Glenda the infinity bottle. So just a few moments ago, I did write the name of a Scotch distillery on this piece of paper. Mm -hmm. So the first person to comment that distillery in the notes will win a little sample as well. It's just a little bonus giveaway. So comment away. You know what would Guess be funny, away, guys? What? If you, you you know you tripped everyone up by doing the same as yesterday. No, I didn't do that. It's not Glen <laughs> Scotia. If you were watching yesterday, it's, it's not, not Glen Scotia. Scotia. Johnny Walker. Johnny Walker. No. Keep trying. Springbank. No. 
I'm watching the Instagram comments too, so okay, feel free to comment on Instagram. Nope, nope, nope. Not Balvenie. We'll start giving not out. Ethan, so. Not McCallum. <laughs> nope, viewers. No, Tom and Tom. Oh, no. I've forgotten what you've written. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I know, I know what it is. Everyone, shut your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I remember. <laughs> the whiskey actually is really, really opening up right now. Aaron, Glenn, Kitchino. Edrel Draw, Ardbeg, Ben Nevis, and Lafroy. It's like some kind of awesome uh, whiskey menu. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I always, I always <laughs> love to watch it because there's so many different Absolutely. options to choose from. Yeah. It's a great game. Ardmore, Glen Libet, Talisker. I'll start giving clues soon. I'll give it another minute. Hmm. Good guesses in here. <coughs> um, Feldy, Glen Biddick. I'm actually losing my voice today. Laura, Tobamori! Woohoo! Oh. Tana Lewis! Tana oh, Lewis, you had it! Tobamori is the answer. Well Tana Lewis, please be so, in touch. Send us a DM you. with your address and we will get and send a, a sample of the lovely Glenda sent out to you. Absolutely. Should we ask them to send a video singing um, What's the Story About the Mori? <laughs> they do is film it on the, on, the, on the Isle of <laughs> Mori. So I found Indeed. out today. Indeed. They filmed Balamori and Tobamori. Oh, of course they did. <laughs> <laughs> well educated. Right, so the all remains today is us to draw. Oh, we did draw earlier the Feta Cairn winner. Ooh, I did do that on comment picker. And I shall reveal now. Da -da -da -da. Drum roll, please. The winner is. Well, I haven't had much of a drum roll, sorry. Drum roll, Alex. Alex, Alex. No, I don't do drums. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda Rose! Yes. Yes. Congratulations! Well done. Well done. Yeah, flashing. Flashing. I mean, Amanda flashing. Keep clicking the mouse. <laughs> Amanda Rose Smith, so, congratulations. Be Please touch. be in touch and send your address. Um, and we will get that Petty Ken 12 from yesterday out to you. So well done to you. Yes. If you want to be in with the chance to win this absolute beauty, which we just tried earlier. Glen Roth is 25. 25. Then you need to share this video, like our page, like the links, tag your friends. And if you want to win this, next Thursday we will be drawing this. And this will be everybody that buys one of our advent calendars or our 1999 whiskey subscription boxes from our website and put the code in. Big and draw. Big just, draw. Um, just to tell everyone, this subscription pack, our next one is Halloween. So actually this week is the perfect week to ah, purchase one. Indeed. So, so we'll be going go. live at 8 on Sunday. What was it? The 31st. Absolutely. And if you're not free on Halloween, don't worry, you can watch it afterwards. Indeed. All right, that's all from us. Keep bye watching. Bye. See, you. See you Monday. Bye. bye.